So I want to catch you up on what I've been doing in my little junk journal, July junk journal. And this must begin with, you've seen that. I haven't done my reinvent page just yet. Just trying to keep up. Um, number four was transparent. So I had a little go at a shaker. Um, not very shakeable because I didn't put enough things in. I did a transparent on this page as well. So it's just some vellum over some music paper because I wanted to do my fold out on this page. So it's just like a tuck spot fold out side pocket belly band whichever you want to use it for my bouquet and I did a bit of a bright one and just a tag with bouquet on it as usual I'm going to just be using the stuff out of this box this big bag of scraps so it's very challenging and I'm going to keep it super simple because there's no other way I can do this okay so while I am digging out some bits to use i don't know what i'm going to use what i'm not i just want to say thank you to the hostess of this collaboration which is meg of meg's journals um I might put some of this on i don't know i think we've probably got enough i think maybe we won't use that but we'll see and it's it's something i haven't done before i haven't done a um junk journal july so it's all pretty new to me. Now I'm wondering how much of this I need. I just want to put a little bit in the middle just to take away the blank, the blankness of the pages. You know, it doesn't really matter. I just wanted to pretty them up a bit. Okay, I'm going to put so. this one further up just because... I might want to write something at the bottom. Okay, so let's let them dry a minute. I might put symmetry there. We will see. So what I'm going to do is just grab some scraps. I might use this because it's it's super cool. I don't need to use that side. Um, no. As you can see, I'm doing a journal for um, a very young child. <laughs> and it's, uh, um, let's just go with that. So I've got out all my sort of kiddies papers, which is fine. I don't, I don't know if I want the straight edge. Do you know what? I don't want the straight edge bit. I'm going to have more two torn edges. I want it all torn. Let's get all them edges off. I could ink them. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to build layers up on this. Some vellum. So again, can I rip it? Yep. I'm just going to rip layers of these. Uh, let's take that off there. Have I got two of these? Oh, I haven't got two of them. Right, so this one's going to have to be super thin because I've only got one. Um, go with that. And again, I'm going to just take off these straight edges. Who wants straight edges? I think I will ink. I might grab my ink in a minute just to finish them off. So let's go with this one. This is a lovely colour. I like this one. Yeah, I have to leave for work slightly earlier today because I've decided I'm going to start cycling when I can. Sort of build my strength back up in my legs. And it's a lovely day and it doesn't forecast any rain. <laughs> the last time I was going to go, they forecast a storm. So, so I didn't. I thought, no, maybe not. Maybe I'll just take the car. It's only about two and a half miles from my house to where I work. So it's not, it's not a long way. And um, 
I can easily cycle it. So I'm just lazy and I'm a very fair weather cyclist. I don't I don't like to cycle in in like the rain and <laughs> the really cold. I just I don't know. I, I'm just wussy, I think. Um I was gonna use that, but I don't think I'm going to. Okay, right, let's go with what we've got, guys. So I'm gonna go gonna make them symmetrical so we're gonna do this I'm gonna have a little bit of vellum on either one and some of this maybe the vellum can go on top that'd be nice let's layer them up a bit of this Oh, I've got all the greens together. I need some pink, don't I? I need this pink on. Maybe peeking out from behind there. <laughs> this one's got a fold. So we may turn that round because it's going to make it tricky. Pop that on. Um, let's put... Um, I need that, don't I? I'm going to put that one on. And then this one over the top. And we're, we're sort of there. So what all I'm going to do now is just move them up and down slightly. Now I've got my place. This one needs to be bigger. Oh, I can't see the pretty one at the bottom. Right, so I think I'm there with that one. And because I've got it all together, and for speed reasons, I'm going to clip it maybe a couple of paper staples in it and this one can't be quite as big there we go and then we're just going to put our focal point on the top or are we going to do it something different let's see what it looks like so we're going to put this right up that way or this way. I quite like it. Now I could put it on as a tuck, but I think I'm just going to use it as a, what do you call it? Sort of side cluster. Just to decorate the edge of the page. Oh, what I do need is something on the other side now. <laughs> I will do that. Because you can see all, the, all that bit. So we could put it on. Just double check the other side. It's fine. Glue it down. Now, where are we putting these? I was going to put them over the staples, but I think I'm just going to like tuck them a little bit maybe like that I told you it's going to be a really quick one today and if anywhere is is sort of loose like here <laughs> I can just put some glue on it didn't quite catch it with either of the staples but you know it's not the end of the world just put a bit of glue on tuck it back under there we go and then wipe off the excess glue there's always excess glue all the time right hopefully this hasn't been too long for you and i will keep you up to date with maybe i'll put this one down the bottom with with my next sort of couple of days and we'll see how we go now I want to put symmetry down, so I'm thinking I might back it. I may back it onto that. Because I only printed these on paper. I was going to just put it in the beginning of the book, but then I decided I was going to put, put them on every page.
like that. Oh, I should have put them on that side. Look, that was pretty. So there we go. That's my symmetry page. Okay, so I sort of went out of order. <laughs> <laughs> it was going to happen, wasn't it? That's because I was catching up and I think I'd just done that page and then went back and did bouquet. Uh, number eight was wallpaper and I couldn't find a solid frame so I've just used a die cut frame. And this is my wall with my picture on it. So it's wallpaper. And then we're up to number nine which is clashing colours. No, clashing patterns. There we go. So I've had a load of fun with this one and just put some napkin um i've done some circles and blobs and diamonds i've done paint gelatos i've stuck pictures down <laughs> this one was huge fun and now we're up to time out so what we're going to do for time out right so i've been digging through my bag of scraps which doesn't seem to be going down <laughs> nine days in and I've still got just as many scraps what I have done is I have popped off and grabbed a magazine because I wanted some writing and I thought that was quite cool so I'm gonna add that um, it's not it's not part of my bag but you know I'm making the rules so all I want to do is just going to be the simplest page ever because I want, I've want i got a lot to do today and I just want to get this finished and I want to get up to date so that I can do some stitching because I'm, I'm, you know, I'm doing the Roxy's Journal of Stitchery and I am not, I'm way behind. I haven't done anything on that since last week, so... I really need to do that. So this is going to be a very simple page. Quite med meditated. Meditation. I'm going to I'm going to rip for speed's sake and because I like ripped edges. And I'm just going to rip these to the size of the page very quickly and glue that on. I may turn that one into a pocket because you never know when you might need a pocket. There we go. Put that lid on. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> the lid didn't want to go on. So just going to glue that down. Pretty sure that's... Okay, it's sticking out. We're going to cut that off. That's fine. See if I can get back into the... Um... The right order. Don't really want that green sticking out through there with the scribbles on it. So that's one half. This is off an old calendar in case you hadn't guessed. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to match it up and then just take off that one there I'm sort of toying with the idea of making this very art journaly now I think I've got I think I'm going that heading in that direction with this because I've never done a junk journal July so I'm, I weren't quite sure what to do whoops <laughs> apart from put pictures on upside down <laughs> I'm sort of heading towards the, um, you know, more art journaly than, and maybe collage a bit. Got glue on that now. That's all right because the words can go on there. Now, should we rip? I think we should rip because that's what I'm doing. So, without light. There is no space. Sort of just something to think about. Meditate about. Slow down. 
it's Sunday. I am doing this actually on the right day, which I think is pretty impressive that I've managed to catch up. And it is my video making day and my chill day because I worked yesterday. Now, do I want to ink this? Nah. No, I don't. Might pop that up there. I'm not going to think about this too much. I am just popping it down. Popping it down. Now, what are we going to do about this little bit that has nothing on it in this corner? Um, I need my ten. Time out. That's cool how that's worked for Sunday. I like that. I, I like that. And I've started cutting my numbers separately from my writing as well. Be interesting to see what it's like at the end. How I've um, progressed through. So I'm thinking... I can put these up here. I don't know whether it makes any sense, but oh, hello. What are you doing? There's piles of paper. Obviously, I want to sit on them because you might need them. I'm going to put them up there. Where's that A tissue? And I've got out my gel pens and I thought I might do some, I don't know what I'm doing with this yet. I might just, I might just leave it. <laughs> but I thought I might just do a bit of random doodling. Just because I can't just stick three pieces of paper down and say that's done. Well, I suppose you could, there's no rules, no rules. So I'm not going to make get all of this done on video, but I will be showing you the ones I I can. July is such a busy month, and also I'm going away, so I'm trying to get like all the bits ready for the caravan. <laughs> right, I've got to wash it today. It needs a clean. Is it? We we haven't used it yet this year, so. I'm quite, I'm quite, it, it's too, too hot to be washing it just yet. So I've got to do that later on. Hello. What do you want? You want to sit right there? Of course you do. Yeah, I know. What do you want? Yeah, I'm sorry for the furry intrusion into our day. I know some of you like her. I um, apologise for those of you who do not like cats, but she is, she, she, she's, she lives here. So, you know, yeah, I'm getting head bumps. She obviously wants something. I wonder what that might be. Who thinks it might be dreamies? What is it about those cat snacks that they all love? This isn't even level, guys. <laughs> I'm going to turn upside down because I can't do it that way. I know. I know. Head bumps and everything. You are funny. Okay. Sort of quite like that. I'm not going to do the pattern at the bottom. Can we do, what can we do with that little bit? We could put like a tab on the page. I don't really want to do it in red. Let's see what we've got. Can you like move? <laughs> could put like a tab on there. That's quite pretty. I think I'll just do that. Doesn't
doesn't take much. I'll just grab another bit of scrap out of that bag because I want to use them up. That is the whole point, purpose. My that's what my um my plan is for junk journal July is to use up some of my scraps, as you know. I don't think I can put anything else on there. Can't really find anything because somebody's sitting on everything. I know. It'd be quite cool to put some sort of clock on there, wouldn't it? But I don't think I've got one. No, it doesn't go at all. Ooh, put something up there. I have to remember that I can... When we come to 11, which is fussy cutting, that I'm going to see this bit. Okay, I think I'm going to leave it like that, guys. I am so pushed for time today. But we're going to have a time out. <laughs> we're having a time out now, aren't we? We're going to go and get some lunch. Yeah, going to get some lunch. <laughs> and I'll see you soon. Bye.